Okay, hi everybody. I'm doing an early film this week because on Friday we're going to be very busy with our summer fair. Uh, we've got lots of fantastic things organised for you, so please come along and help support us. This year the funds that we're raising on the summer fair are to help support our early years department who have got some great things on a wish list but are way too expensive at the moment for us to afford out the academy budget. So as much as we can possibly raise on the summer fair will go towards helping support that so please help us out. Reminder it starts at half past two. You'll be allowed just before that onto the playgrounds to go to your child's class to collect them. If your child is in reception or Mrs Smith's or Mrs McNally's class, we're going to encourage you to come into school through their classroom doors and collect them from the classroom. That's hopefully to stop any bottleneck in that area. If your child is in Mr Milfull's class, you need to go around the back of school and we'll let them out through the emergency exit for the library. It would really help us if you're not intending to have anybody pick your child up early from school that you could let us know on the Friday morning because staff will then keep your children safe with them. Uh, we would love any donations of home baking or any um, buns that you can buy for us, send those in either tomorrow or on Friday morning, that would be wonderful. We are wanting the year sixes as many as wish to stay to stay. If your child's a year six and they've already put their name down for a stall, then permission slips have already been sorted for those children. But if your child's saying that they'd like to stay and help right to the end of the event, please just send a letter in um, giving permission that they can walk home or you will collect them after the 3.30 normal finishing time. Some of the prizes that we've got this year are absolutely staggering. Raffle prizes, we've got flower arrangements, we've got beers from a local brewery, spa, hampers, giant cookies. Those some of our raffle prizes, thank you very much if you've already bought your tickets. Um, we had last year the washing line event, which was really successful. This is gonna be a prize every time. You choose your envelope and inside there will be a prize for you. It's gonna be two pounds a go, because this year we have got some amazing things to put inside our envelopes. We've got gift cards for a local um, toy shop, We've got lots of fish and chip prizes to win this year from Tony's and from Weatherby Whaler. We've got £5 from a local butcher's. We've got uh, gift cards for Build-A-Bear and we've got five gift cards for children to go and attend a bug event. So lots of things, always a prize on that one. The silent auction this year, I think some parents have excelled themselves in going out there and getting us some fantastic things to put on the silent auction. If you're not aware what that is, basically you need to look for me on Friday and in front of me I will have a stall with clipboards and items on there. The things that this year we can put down a bid for is an overnight stay in Bridlington, a week's worth of doggy daycare, some hours worth of cleaning to come into your house and clean for you. We've got an alpaca walk, family alpaca walk. We've also got a toy hamper and a donation of one of our parents is a talented tattooist and she's gonna do a tattoo of your choice. So what happens on the silent auction is you come along, you see which one of the gifts you'd like to have, pop your name down and your contact details and how much you're willing to pay for it. But be careful, because the next person who comes along might be willing to pay more. So they'll cross your name out and put theirs down. Always a fun event. You don't have to pay on the day for those things, so you don't need the cash for those, but you will need cash for everything else, because unfortunately, we don't have any card machines. So please come along and support us. We're hoping it's gonna be an absolutely fantastic day. Thanks everybody, see you Friday. Fingers crossed for no rain, please. Bye.